Hi guys, welcome back. So I am super, super excited to do this video. Um, so I'm gonna give you a bit of a backstory. As a brand, we buy quite a lot of top tier brands from all over the world and we constantly test the chemicals and we test the product lines for durability, obviously glass, ease of use, many, many things. Um, combination of the three or the five, whichever kind of criteria we're looking at. So that's just part of our research and development budget and our time. Um, so again, this is gonna be a similar project, but mainly it's not designed for that purpose. So Kelly has decided to surprise me with, for the people who know, they will know this. Um, it's, it's Ammo NYC. So that's all I'm gonna say about it. Um, Larry from Ammo, um, he's based out of New York. Um, I've emailed him quite a few times, we've had a few you know, conversations, but he's just a super cool dude. Um, it's a one-man band, obviously his wife helps him out. So, um, and he's got a cracking, from what I've heard, he's got a cracking product line. Um, again, he develops it in a very similar way to us. Um, it's all more of the development and the final result rather than just mass producing rebottled labels and obviously products. Um, so there's a few similarities with the way that we work and he works. But Kelly decided to surprise me this. Um, and the main reason I'm doing this video is I just want to geek out with you guys. There's not many UK people who have done a review um, on this. Price to me doesn't matter. So all these YouTube reviewers will start labeling on price, which is just completely useless and just pointless. Um, to me, this is all about user experience. Um, I'll just give you an example. The custom charges and the shipping charges came to about 170 pound. Just for that, you've then got to upfront the cost of the products. Now, the box is unpacked, um, or it's, it's unopened. I don't know what's inside here. Kelly said, please do an unboxing video. Um, so I am as surprised as you're gonna be. But again, price is out the question for me on this. I don't care if it's a pound, 50 pound a bottle, doesn't really matter. Um, I know his product line, so obviously I've looked on the website, I've, I've, I've had a look already. So in my head, I know what each product roughly is, but I'm gonna open this up for you. We're gonna do a live unboxing. I'm gonna try and talk as much as I know about the brand, but then there's gonna be a follow-up video from this, just the usability of, of the products. And it's just gonna be impartial. We're just gonna use it as if we're normal people. And as I said, I just wanna geek out over the brand. It's quite a revered brand. And again, because of the cost to get over to the UK, not many people do it. So she surprised me, she's a good woman. Um, please give a massive thumbs up to Kelly for this. Um, but potentially we could test it on the GTS or another car, I'm not sure yet. So. Again, the trusty old knife. And let's see what's inside. I am, I'm like a little child at Christmas. I love, you know, if there's some, I have got a few examples I can give to you to this, but as I said, there's a few well-developed brands in the world and this is just cool. So again, there's a the box. Don't know what's in it. Paper. So first of all, wait, is that two ammo stickers or one? So you've got a red one and you've got a blue one. Oh, a black one, it's black. Um, super cool already. As you can tell guys, <laughs> this is more of a, a passion project for me more than anything else. So. For the people who know me, Norms just love geeking out over this stuff. So yeah, two stickers. Right, ooh. Oh. Small bottle, already in the soul again, small bottle. People don't know the brand, might not know what this is, but I already know what this is. But I don't know if it's his old version or the new version. So. This is the new one. So Ammo Reflex, it's the sheet coat, so it'll be the 2.0 version. Nice boxes. But again, Ammo. Um, so Reflex, from what I've been reading, watching the views, it's not a coating, so it's not a ceramic, it's not got silica dioxide or anything like that in. Um, the word Reflex is named actually quite well. 
um, it's, it molds around the body, okay? So it always moves as people, well, the people in the know know that when you start doing heat on the clear coat, not the paint, the clear coat, um, heat, cold, the paint flexes. So it's like a bit like metal. I'm sure if you go on YouTube it, and you see that things always flex. Now, reflex, it moves kind of in and around the body. So I'll be super interested to see um, how this works. The good thing is, so 15 mil, 15 mil of product, tiny bottle, um, So we'll see, we'll see how it reacts. Now this is a, a system, so you can put it on its own. It's gonna get a certain result, which would be great. Um, but if you start layering the systems, um, it works even better. So yeah. <laughs> so again, people that know me know that I'm a big wax advocate now. We apply coatings, you know, five, seven year packages, self-healing packages here. Um, but I will always be a wax man. Now, a wax to me, a lot of manufacturers now are, are doing waxes that last three months, six, 12 months, and it's just getting harder and harder to use. Now, a real wax should be a pleasure to use. It should provide only one thing, realistically, um, is just the warm glow, the depth in the paint. Um, a bit of durability is obviously going to be there. Um, hydrophobics are going to be there. It's not going to be like a coating. However, this is a wax. But when you get it right, it's amazing. Oh, in fact, so before I open it, it's a nice part. What are we looking at? Eight fluid ounces. What's that? 200 mil, if I'm correct, American speak. But big pot. Yeah, probably the size of my hand. Ammo cream. I just love collecting expensive waxes. Now I know this wax is fairly expensive. This is fairly expensive too. I need to surprise Kelly. Do I take her for a meal? <laughs> interesting. Very interesting. So the reason why I say interesting, the color reminds me of something, but then I, the smell also reminds me of something. Um, I won't mention what. I know this is developed from the ground up. Um, it is very oily. But again, as from what I know about this wax, it is designed to be a show wax. This is going to be the last product, so the LSP is the last stage product. Um, on top of your mainstream protection, whether it be ceramics, sealants, reflex, um, designed to give it that final glow and the final pop so ammo reflex um ammo skin not skin cream Ooh, another box i'm gonna geek out on this massively first of all i'm gonna sit for a couple of hours and just smell them Ooh. Let's have a look. Oh, four bottles, obviously. Triggers. I'll put my own triggers on these. All right. Spit UV inhibitor. So I think spit is more of a spray wax, detail spray. Um, so I think it's more of a detail spray, spray wax category. It's sealed. Let me crack this. Yeah. All right. The color's pink. <sighs> nice smell. A strawberry scent, a berry scent of some sort. So it's loose. Again, ammo spit. Ammo skin, nice. That's the full paint regimen. So ammo does, um, he calls them regimens. So he has wheel, paint regimens, interior regimens. Now, 
the pain regimen, the complete one. See, I didn't think I've, I've got this. I've certainly looked at this one um, already, but it's the, obviously I'm not gonna get the website up now, but it's um, the ammo pain regimen. So basically what it is, which is completely correct on, you've got to build layers on top of your clear coat. Um, and that's, yes, you can use wax on its own, you can use ceramic on its own, that's fine. But if you start building layers up, his analogies of wearing coats and windbreakers, it's the same thing. So you've got the base coat of reflex, you've then got ammo skin, which is the, the sealant, so the fully synthetic sealant. So one, two, and then you get the wax on top. So you've got a three stage system. <laughs> I'm gonna be high today. So it's got a very manly smell to that. More of an aftershavey smell. Nice, what's this? Hydrate, oh, I've heard many things about this. Many, many things. So ammo hydrate. Now, how do I describe this? It's, it's not a spray wax, so it's actually quite thick. It's a very thick consistency in there. I mean, I don't know if the camera's gonna pick that up. You're probably not gonna see that. But it's like a bluey color. Um, it is quite a, a gloopy liquid, so obviously it's a spray application. Now when the car's wet, um, you use a, a couple of microfiber towels with this on it. So basically you're moisturizing or hydrating the paint. Um, really interested. Um, really, it's, I've heard a lot of reviews about this in the States. Again, nobody in the UK really talks about this, um, but it's this product for what this is this is a very very expensive product now as i said price not going to come into it who cares um user experience and how it performs on the car is going to be the main thing but we'll have a look and then you've got foam paint cleanser so it's a snow foam um now this will be an interesting comparison privately i may put a video up as well in the membership about this um, and maybe that's where we do the comparison video. Um, impartially, of course. So foam. It's got these, pl I love these plugs, by the way. If anybody knows packaging, knows that these plugs that go in like this are an absolute lifesaver. Lifesaver. Smells nice as well, the foam now. That's thick, that's a very, very thick foam. Never seen one like this before. Um, but anyway, that is it, so. Mega, I am ready to geek out with you guys. Um, so again, this is, the, this is the paint regimen here itself. So that's gonna go on a car and I think with this you're probably expecting around 12 months from what I've read, heard, seen. Again, depends on the maintenance of the car. If you start washing your car with bleach, it's gonna last you a week. Um, so I'm really excited to try this out. Um, this, you can do a bit more Googling. So ammo spit, UV inhibitor. Um, quick detailer, spray wax, somewhere in that region. Again, detail spray and spray wax, two completely different products. That's why I said I don't know which one it is. Um, I'm laying on the, if my memory serves me correct, this is more of a spray wax. Again, hydrate, very interesting. I mean, look, you can, you, you can hear it's quite gloopy. Whereas this, yeah, you, you can hear, this is a, just a normal loose liquid. This is thick. Um, same with, in fact, you can't even hear the foam, it's that thick, but yeah. Um, excited to try this guys. As I said, there is going to be no reviews here. This is not a review. This is just me being Nick and geeking over a product, which I have never, I've never used any of the products. Um, I have just been watching the YouTube and reading the forums. Um, I think it's very rare that people do buy ammo stuff in the UK because as I said, because of the price, first of all, because of the product price. 
and then because of the import charges and stuff like that, um, it's not cheap, but then again, if you want something, you pay for it. Um, I think it's a fair price on all the products. Um, obviously, the, I don't count the import tax and the shipping because it's just life, import tax, you have to pay everywhere. Um, but I may try it on this. Um, again, this car hasn't been paint corrected, hasn't even been cleared yet. It's a simple wash, so again, I'm going to do the thorough steps to decon this car, polish the car um, prior to application, or I may already get a car that is already prepped and ready, um, one of our personal cars, and try it on there. But maybe on this it's black. This is the only black car that we have. So I'm really, really excited. Um, so I just want to say thank you to Kelly. This is an absolute dream surprise. Thank you very much. Um, Larry, if you watch this, I, again, I've been a personally a big fan, just forget the business element here, I've been a personal big fan of just his achievements. And he's a cool, cool guy. Um, so I will do a follow-up video on this video that I'm going to be using the product. Um, and hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. I'm, I don't know if you can tell, I'm super, actually overwhelmed a little bit. It, Wizgar's like a little bit of a celebrity in the scene. Um, again, we aspire to be like that at some time in the future, however long that may take. Um, but from what I've heard, they're great. So as you can tell, I'm super excited um, and I can't wait to use the products. But guys, again, I hope you've enjoyed another unboxing video. Um, and I welcome your questions both publicly and privately. So if you watch this video, let me know what you think and obviously ask as many questions as you want. The bottles are gonna be here, okay? Um, so if you wanna have a feel of them, smell of them, look at them, um, just give me a shout um, and I'll obviously be sure to show you around. But guys, thank you very much for watching um, and I will catch you on the next one, thank you.